Niaje ma guys? Kopoa, kam kopoa, pia min kopoa. Late over charge. Then I represent Rona Riders. So today we are at Hellsgate for the Loop Safari Gravel Series third edition. So what was interesting about the Hellsgate series? First of all, it's a UCI certified race. It's the first one I've managed to do and the first one in Kenya. So definitely we called it miss. Loop have really put in a lot of work to give us an extraordinary race here. And the gun is gone and the rest has started. Up or two adrenaline in the check-in. Kidogo kidogo, it's not even five kilometers in. Someone in front of me is about to crash and falls into my path. Uzuri, I managed to swerve, evade him, and I go on with my race. Middle of the climb. What do I realize? That the, that the lead group, Balakina Lucas Bam, and other senior riders, other pro riders, I've uh, um, already finished the 20km loop and they're on their way back. So looking at them, I'm just with the speed, man. The speed. So like, hey, these guys can't be normal, man. But you know what? We have our own race to do. First guy to catch up with me is uh, Zen. Zen is like, hey, 20, 20, 20. I try to, you know, hold on to his wheel. But two kilometers, hey, Zen is a strong lad, man. He leaves me Uko in the, in the dust. Then I realized, Bala, I'm not operating at my optimum. I'm wondering, hey, she did go happy, Bala. As kia migu, Bala, ay, leo si kawaida. So in my, in my head, na jambia, must be because I didn't warm up for the race. So we finish the climb, and we start descending an early descent, Bala. Kona tumawe mawe, kidogo kidogo, hapo mbele. I think I spotted a Rwandese rider with a pink canyon bike. Alikuwa me crash up with one. He forgot them, but sorry for him. Kendelea, we finished the health gate section. I started chasing hard on the tarmac. Because I'm riding a gravel bike, I knew I had an advantage of a mountain bike, guys. Just as we caught up with them, we were turning into Kedong Ranch. My guys, up on the Kedong Ranch is, if you're familiar with Safari Rally, when it gets to Kedong Ranch, is a term they use, fresh fresh. So fresh fresh is basically sand trucks. And for you to ride through fresh fresh, you have to ride your bike as powerful as you can to get through it, but it sucks the energy out of you. Kidogo Kidogo, Frankie ca catches up with me. So I follow Frankie for like three kilometers. Frankie is nowhere to be seen. That's when I realized today I was the nail. Uh, finally, I got to the feed zone. Uh, I think I sat there like 10 minutes just enjoying the watermelon, the bananas and the water. Pulled myself a bit. That's when I realized I'm eating, but the, it's not translating to energy. Basically, nilikuwa nime hit the wall. Nilikuwa nime bonk. The last time I felt that, I think it was my first race I did. And that's some nine years or so. I started racing in 2015, but I'm almost 10 years into racing. And I'm glad about that. And I want to thank my teammates from the riders for showing up. In fact, there was a whole village set up for us. We had Ambuzi on the house and a few drinks to Kaletewa, Sherehe, Sherehe, as we dissect the race. So all this is what made this race a spectacular race. I want to thank NCBA, I want to thank Luke for hosting such a lovely race. Machore.